Hey, good morning, Lauren. Um, hopefully this video will help you to figure out how to assign different assignments to different groups within your math class so that you can use it with your exemplars. Um, I know we talked a little bit about this on Monday morning, but um, I know that you have, like if this is block one, for me, I'm gonna use Hopewell. And then I have within Hopewell, I have um, different groups. So I know we talked a little bit about how you drag the kids over into the different groups. So this would be like group A to do a certain exemplar and group B to do a different exemplar. Um, or you can assign the same one to them and then have like a group C and D do a, a separate one. So once you have your kiddos in groups, then you'll want to create your assignment. And so to create our assignment, click add an assignment which I know you know how to do and then I'm going to scroll down and decide like say I'm going to do um, a file upload and so I do need to click that it's a group assignment and that I'm going to pull from whatever the, the category is that's holding all of your different um, smaller groups And then when I go down here and I click to assign, that is now because I selected the group part up above, that's what's going to let me choose the groups that I want to assign this particular assignment to. So I can just assign it to A, I can also assign it to B, and then maybe, you know, C and D do a different one. Um, so that's my exemplar assigned to A and B. And then I'm going to click Save and Publish. Um, then what we would need to do then is once that is save and, saved and published is we would need to click on assignments again and add another assignment with the other exemplar and then go in and assign it to the groups that we want to. So hopefully that makes sense. Um, if you need help with anything or if this isn't exactly what you were going for, please just let me know um, and then also let me know how it goes with your kiddos. Um, I'm curious to see, do you know what I mean, from their perspective, what they think. Um, even if you want me to come into your classroom when you try it out with them, I'm happy to do that too. So hope you have a good rest of the day and let me know if you need anything.